Kyler, thank you. Good time to do things indoors. Mm -hmm. The largest and oldest gem and mineral show in the world open today for its 65th year. Nine on your size, Taja Davis is at the TCC and gives us a glimpse at opening day. Taja. Pat Val, now opening day is closing up shop right now as the gym and mineral show does end at 6 p.m. most nights. Now, there are thousands of gyms and minerals here with vendors from around the country and the world. But here is a little bit about one mineral that is stealing the show. It's beautiful. The minerals are large, colorful, lustrous, tabular crystals, often jimmy, clear. What Mark Hay is describing is this the mineral wolfenite. This year's Tucson Gym and Mineral Show centered its theme around this fiery stone. Wolfenite was officially named Arizona State Mineral in 2017. We had a state rock, which is petrified wood. We've got state animals and things such as that, but Arizona did not have a mineral. And there's a lot of minerals in the world. The one mineral that is a real crowd pleaser that nobody in the globe beats Arizona on is wolfenite. Hayes says there are eight wolfenite localities in Arizona alone, as well as some in Mexico, Africa, and Europe. Wolfenite is a lead by lip date made from lead deposits, which Southern Arizona has a lot of. And Arizona's groundwater is so deep, we have a lot of oxygen that's exposed to those lead minerals. So Arizona is very blessed geologically with its wolfenite localities. Discovered in Germany by Franz von Wolfen in 1845, this gemstone is featured in dozens of displays and vendor booths in this year's showcase. The Tucson Convention Center will open again tomorrow, bright and early at 10 a.m. And the gym show does continue until February 17th. Taja Davis, Kagan 9 on your side. All right, thank you, Taja. There are as many stories as there are gems and minerals at the TCC.